Okay, so I don't want to gossip, but Martin Luther King was not the saint that you people thought he was. He did some pretty evil things, and it will be revealed by 2027. In seven years, the, the FBI is going to release footage of him having, you know, of, we don't know what's going to happen, but they're going to release footage of him having sex with women. He had sex with over 40 prostitutes, you know. And Coretta Scott King knew about this, but she kept it a secret. Um, the FBI stalked um, Martin, Martin Luther King for half his life, for, for about a couple years of his life. They videotaped his every move. Also, it is known that Martin Luther King watched a preacher uh, molest a, 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 a woman. You know, he was, I said, they, they, it was known he, that Martin, Martin Luther King had sex orgies, I, you know, he, that he had sex parties, that he was bad, you know, he was smoking, you know, he was, a, he did, he was drinking and smoking. So all that he was a Christian and all of this stuff that he was supposed to be was a lie. You know, he was just pretending that, you know, in the speeches, he looks like an innocent man. And deep down, he was just evil, which everything is going to, we don't know what's going to, what they're going to, they have the foul reports. Everything is going to be re released in seven years, unless they change it. I hope not. I knew about this five years ago. You know, for years, I've been hearing that he, he and he would, he would sleep with prostitutes. He would, you know, he had a, you know, not that he, I mean, but other than that, I don't think he did anything else that was bad. But they said he was known making fun of the president, JFK. That he was, you know, so everything about him is going to be released to the world. His family doesn't know. His family knows that he was not, he was bad. He was a bad man. That he was a con artist. That everything he did, the civil rights movements, he even made fun of white people. You know, they have everything on the surveillance tapes. Now, the reason that Martin Luther King wanted to in integrate with white people was not because he wanted black and white people to be together. It was because he wanted his family to uh, go to the theme parks, you know, you know, he wanted to take his family to the zoo. You know, black people were not allowed in zoos, and they were not allowed, not allowed at the carnivals. You know, it was all white people. He did it for the wrong reasons. Civil rights movement was was for his own personal pleasures. His kids kept asking, "Why can't?" I hang around white white kids, and why can't I go to the zoo with the white kids? And why can't this put these kids put guilt on him? Well, this is one of the reasons why he did everything that he did. It was not just because he wanted black people, white people to be together. Maybe, but but it is mostly because he wanted his kids not to feel like they're outsiders or outcasts, you know, or feel like they're you know like they're different because they can't be around white people. It was for his own personal pleasures. But all I'm going to say is. In seven, thing, in seven years, everything about Martin Luther King is going to be revealed. The FBI followed his every move. They, 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 you know, they got video recordings of him having sex with women. And, get, and who knows what else they have about him. They, they, he did some pretty evil things. And once, these, once, they, once the FBI releases, and I'm not an FBI guy. I know I, I'm, I'm saying a lot of things that, that most people would not talk about. But, you know, um, I'm pretty nosy. Too. I do my research. You know, I'm not an FBI, but I'm, I, 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 I do my research. You know, I'm a black guy who does his research, you know. But in seven years, everything's going to come out. You know, he's going to, you know, his his name is going to be, nobody's going to want to talk about him after, in seven years. When, I mean, people know about it now, you know, but nobody's going to want to. The movie Selma actually kind of gave it away that there was a scene where Coretta Scott confronts her husband, Martin Luther King, and asks him, um, she asked, she asked him, did he have sexual relations with the woman when he was making those noises or he was just playing with himself? She said, no, he, he denied it. And he said that he was just pleasuring himself, that he did not have sexual relations with those women, that it was all fake. You know, everything's going to come out in seven years, 2027. It's all sealed up now. The government has the files and I cannot wait to get to them. In seven years, the whole world is going to know who he was. That he was not innocent, that he did have a lust for prostitutes, and I mean, it doesn't make him a bad person. He just had a, a lust, but he but he did some pretty pretty freaky things though. It wasn't oh he had sex with a prostitute. He had sex with over forty prostitutes, and he also had or sex parties. Some a lot of weird stuff that he did. Mr. J here, peace.